What's up guys? So back with another video. We got a video today on the Xiaomi Mi Max 3. This is that China device I was telling you about. Seven inch display. Now it's kind of sexy. Now out of the box, they're gonna have a few, th few things. Number one, it's not gonna have Google Play installed and you have to play around with the APN settings for your provider. In my case, I'm using it on AT&T and Verizon. So the first part to get Google Play working is you wanna head in, I'm gonna drop this down in, the down in the description where you can go, but you go on Google, you go in Mi Max 3 install, it's the first link, it's on the official MUI. You download this installer here, which is a zip. You unzip it on your, on your phone, it'll be an APK. You install it. I already have it installed, but you know, we can go through it. I just won't do everything. The bottom, it looks like, looks like this. Let's see if I can get it closer so you guys can see it. It'll look something like that, depending on your theme. You're gonna click and you're gonna get something that looks like this. You won't be able to read it or whatever, but now you're gonna click the blue button and then it's gonna go through and you're gonna see something like this. In my case, you're gonna see that it overwrites. You're gonna keep hitting install every time and then when it's finished, just hit done. Never press open, go all the way to the end and keep pressing it. In my case here, I'm gonna hit cancel just because I already did it. Now it's gonna go through all of this, it's gonna install all the services, blah, blah, blah. Now, very important, you might have seen me tweet about this and whatnot, but very important. You wanna go into your search or however you get to your settings. Go to settings, then you're gonna go down to installed apps. Uh, this part is completely up to you the way you do it. This is the China ROM. I mean, it's gonna be the same on any of them, but you're gonna to wanna to set, let's see, Google Play services. You're gonna to wanna to set here, restrict WLAN and mobile data. You're gonna to wanna to set the permissions, this is the important part. I have permissions for everything set. I mean, you could do whatever you want. You can play around to see how you can do it, but you wanna do that. You wanna do Google, you wanna do Google Play, you wanna do the Google Services Framework, and you also wanna make sure that the battery saver is set to no restrictions because it will kill the app. And you go through all the Google ones. I'm gonna keep scrolling through to show you them all. Do it for assistant if you have it installed um important one the one that was failing for me a google account manager google calendar sync and google contact sync those three are very important to get any of this stuff to work google play store just allow it for all and then you can play around with the settings and try to get it now once you do get it working apps such as youtube will allow you to sign in. As you can see, mine is signed in. Play Store will work. Before it wasn't working, you might have seen me tweet and say, how do I fix this? You know, I thought it was my APN settings. I got full LTE, as you can see. Now it all works. So I'm hoping that's gonna be helpful in English. I haven't seen any videos like this in English. This is the first one. Now this is on the MI UI 10 ROM. If that helps you guys. That's the device info. It's the 128 gig Snapdragon 636. Alrighty guys, so if you like this video and you found it helpful, um, just drop it a thumbs up, please. Comments down below if you got any side of comments. I'm not on lock yet, so I'm doing what I can to get, you know, make this phone usable. Before I was like, yeah, I can barely use this thing. But finally got it figured out. Yeah, now I'm rocking it. Alrighty guys, so as usual, you know, drop a thumbs, thumbs up, share it around. I got more videos coming, some stuff from 2D and some other Rinke accessories. Alrighty guys, see you in the next one. Peace. Laters.